Pods to another new episode of the Solar System Legacy Challenge. This is episode 52. So, as you guys can see, I decorated little Vance's room and it's kind of like a nautical theme. So let's take a look so that you guys can see it pretty well. So here is this wall and he's got his little shelves with his clothes and his little car bed. He's got some little toys here. He's got his toy chest. We've got some ships and fish, you know, go with that Mercury Aqua theme. Here's his little case that's got some toys on it. And then over here, we've got his dragon, his little blocks. He's got a ship over here and some little more nautical things and his big ship wheel. And look, he is down there being adorable and playing with his little helicopter and yeah, his little potty training thing. And I have updated him so that he has updated wardrobe as well. So things are looking great. Also, they were all sleeping till the neighbors, of course, started to Ah, oh, you know, Blair music, the typical. And so it looks like Daryl is going to come and vent and yell at this dragon. And Maria is gone to work on her typing or something like that. But let's take a look, guys. I want you to see how precious and adorable little Vance is. I mean, look at that face. Do you guys see that in his little curly hair? <gasps> Oh, precious. He is literally like a spitting image of what I imagine a baby Daryl to look like. And it is seriously the cutest thing ever. But yeah, they are all pretty agitated. Look, Daryl is so angry. He's going to go for a run. He is wanting to ask Medea for food because um, it looks like he is also angry about that. But we need to get him to get some sleep. And Medea is just dancing away in here, apparently. Yeah, practice dancing. And I'm going to have Daryl come over here and bother the Jangs because this is seriously like, why can't we, why can't we bother them? Really uncomfortable. That really hurt. I didn't break anything, but it didn't hurt. It did hurt a little bit. Wow. I can't even like stop them. That's not cool. I don't like that. Ugh. Jeez. So poor Daryl. He is just worn out as can be. But yeah, anyway, so we've got, so let's see, coming up on the calendar, ooh, Harvest Fest is coming. And then we've got Maria's birthday. So we're going to go ahead and add an event. We're going to do a birthday party. And the birthday sim, of course, will be Maria and our guests. Okay, so we are going to do, of course, Sweet Little Vance. And okay, well, hold on. We're going to have this be planned through Maria because yeah it's her friends not Daryl's so okay let's try this again add an event and we're gonna do birthday birthday sim is Maria those that are invited of course Daryl um, Yuki Jasmine Deer Aaron Metasol Clara Gemma Becca Marcus and mm, We'll do Mortimer, I guess, and mm, we'll do Anya. We'll invite Kenji, Alice, Diego, Dawn, Nicole. Oh, we're running out of room. We have too, way too many friends. Okay, okay. So let's take Mortimer off so that we can do Penny. Oh, and I want to do Miko. Okay, we'll take the Jinx off so we can do Miko. Okay, so that is a pretty dang good guest list. We don't want to get a caterer or an entertainer or anything like that. And we're just going to do it here at our residence. Um, if I can find the Charm family residence. Uh, there we go. And we will do it at, we'll do 1 p.m. this time. So 1 o'clock p.m. All right, there we go. So we've got that planned. And of course, we've got Harvest Fest. We'll have to figure out what we're doing for that. So uh, and it's on a Thursday. And do they both have work? Nope, just Medea. But we, she can take the day off from that. That's not a big deal. All right, guys. And it looks like they're growing up. It's a good time for happy reflection as another birthday happens in the family. And Daryl, was he feeling any better? No, not really. Let's see, how is the noise level? 
Oh my gosh. I can't believe that we can't like come over here and knock. Like that's super agitating. This is why we have to move, guys. This is why we really have to move. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, Maria, you gotta come in here. We've gotta do our first bit of correction to our child. Discipline, recent behavior. She's gonna do it firmly. Express her disappointment. All right, girl, come on. She's like, Vance, why would you make a mess like this? Now we have to clean it up. And, oh, and she's just gonna fart right in front of her son and waft her right towards his face. Way to be, Maria, parent of the year. Okay, there we go. That has been cleaned up. And let's see, we can get some, we'll serve some dinner. Let's do, hmm, what would the family want? So we need something that our kid will do. We're just gonna do some grilled cheese. That's a pretty safe thing for kids and parents alike. So, okay, Daryl, he is just, he's starting to feel better actually from all the running. Oh, guys, it's finally quieted down. Okay, this is great. So I'm gonna go ahead and send this little one onto bed because this poor thing is exhausted. Let's get him to sleep. Oh, poor thing. Come on, little boy. There we go, climb into your little race car bed. Yes, there we are. What a sweet boy. Okay, all is right in the world. Okay, it looks like Maria is just going to come in here and sit and eat her grilled cheese while she admires her sweet little boy. Looks like Daryl is getting quite hungry himself. He's going to come grab a serving of some grilled cheese. That sounds really good. Gosh, guys, every time I play this game and they do grilled cheese, like they just be killing me. They're killing me every time. They're just making me want it. Oh, oh, vampire showed up. Thank goodness I locked it to where no vampires are allowed to trespass, which I didn't realize that that was an option before, but I'm glad that I know that. So, but yeah, my gosh, she has seriously been farting so much. Like, it's kind of ridiculous. Oh, look, another vampire. Man, vampires just be wanting to come and suck my blood. Like, for real. It's not cool. Okay, Maria. We need to get her to use the bathroom. And then we're going to have her go back to sleep here for a bit. Daryl, he is cleaning up. He is pretty stinky as well. So we'll have him come and take a shower, use the bathroom. And then we're going to have him come in here and go to sleep as well. All right, guys. So I will see you in the morning. Good morning, everyone. It looks like both Daryl and Maria have the day off work. We are going to continue to let our sweet little boy get his rest. And Maria is off to an early start chatting with some of her friends online. And she has been wanting to woohoo with Daryl. So it looks like we have our little boy's birthday is coming up again in a couple of weeks where he will become a child, which is crazy. Oh my gosh. Oh, are they really going to be, <gasps> is he going to be an elder by then? No way. Oh my gosh. They're getting so old so fast. Okay. Well, Maria has been <laughs> wanting to woohoo with him, as I said. So I'm thinking, you know, they might get a little, mm -hmm, you know what I mean, a little bit busy this morning. So we're going to have her come in here and she is going to, um, let's see. She's going to come in here, wake Daryl up. Let's get her in here. She's like, hey, babe, you want to wake up? How are you feeling? Did you get enough sleep? He's like, oh, yeah, babe, I'm <laughs> way more energetic. These farts are seriously killing me. She is like, oh, babe, I love you so much. He's laughing at her fart. Look at that. So sweet. And looks like they're going to have a little bit of romantic time here. So we're going to... Mm, Let's do a bed make out. We're getting them all in the mood. Congratulations on your recent birthday. All right, so they're getting some conversation in and here we go guys. Time for a good old steamy bed make out session because you know, she feeling a little hot and bothered this morning and she needs to spend time with her boo. So you know why they've got some quiet time while their little baby is away over here getting some nice good shut eye. He's also gonna be really hungry when he wakes up. I've noticed he doesn't seem to be getting his energy bar up very quickly. So we'll have to figure that out. But anyways, they are just busy getting into this. <laughs> and so I think we're going to have them try for another baby, guys. <gasps> what do you think? 
I want them to. They do have to have, as part of the challenge, at least two children. So, you know, if they're going to be elders before I know it, we just need to go ahead and get this done. So we are going to try for a baby. And girl, you just farting every time. Like, that's not very romantic and not setting the mood. I mean, look at this cloud that keeps following her. All right. Well, let's see. She's like, he's like, you want to try again? She's like, you know what? I think I'm ready. Let's do it. So, oh, they are so excited. I'm so nervous, guys. This is always like the like so exciting and so fun, but it's also like nerve-wracking because you just don't know what to expect. Let's check our boy over here. He's doing all right. Looks like he is getting is he stinky? Does he have a stink cloud? No, he doesn't. Okay. We're okay. All right, we got some good hearts going on pillows and feathers. This could be a good one, guys. I mean, remember last time she tried and they didn't get pregnant the first time, but the second time they did. So I guess we'll see how this one goes. Oh, there's a foot. <laughs> Daryl's foot, most definitely. And here we go. We got fireworks, too, and little hearts. All right, Maria, come on. Hurry up and climax. All right, so moving on. Come on, pop out of the covers. There we go. Okay, so now... I need this girl to come over here. And of course our toilet is broken. It's always broken. We're gonna do a pregnancy test, guys. Here we go. And there she goes farting again. My gosh, seriously, never have beanie weenies again because it gives them the farts for like two days. Okay, Maria, what's the verdict? What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? She's not pregnant. Oh, it seems like she struggles each time, like for the first one. It's kind of like heartbreaking. So anyways, we're going to have her kind of just clean up. But okay, well, we did try today. We need our little boy. He is starting to get, it looks like, a little bit stinky. He needs to eat something. So we are going to come over here and get some grilled cheese out for our little one and have him come grab a serving so he can get something yummy to eat. And how he does need attention. And then we do need to take a bath for him. So Daryl looks like he's doing all right. Medea, she could use to eat. She could use to eat something. <gasps> the struggle, guys. Okay. Well, she could get something to eat is what I'm trying to say. And okay, why is Daryl? What is Daryl doing? Daryl, put your son down. He needs to get himself a dang grilled cheese sandwich. Yes, we all know your son is stinky. Okay, but anyways, I was planning on taking them out to like a park or something today so they could spend some time together as a family. So I think that that would be really fun. So anyways, guys, I'm going to get them all ready and needs taken care of and we will head out. Welcome everyone to this beautiful fall afternoon slash evening. So they have come here to the Magnolia Park in Willow Creek. And where is our little sweet little one? Where is precious little Vance? Oh, he's so far. It's going to take him so long to get there. Anyways, we're trying to spend some family time. Daryl was busy raking some of these leaves so that they could try to play in the leaves. So I want to see if we can get sweet little Vance to come play because Maria is wanting to treasure some precious moments with her little boy. And let's see, can these two play a game or something? Let's see, check what's trending. Dance to company anthem. Um, looks like, uh, she is running off to do something. Um, post about day, post about career. Hmm. I'm not really seeing much of anything. He has to use the bathroom. Maria, she was running over here, I guess, to talk with Dustin Broke. We're still waiting for little Vance to slowly make his way over here. It's taking a really long time, so let's fast forward this. Come on, boy. You got it. Oh, he's so cute. Oh my gosh, and it's snowing. Oh, look at this lighting. Oh, Okay, I want Maria and Daryl to come over here because I want them to come watch their little boy. Look at him. He's so cute. Just playing in the leaves, having a good old time with mom and dad. Uh, precious. She's going to watch her little boy. And Daryl's going to come over here and watch his son too. Look at her. Look at that smile little Maria's got. She's like, oh, this is the best. My sweet little boy. He's so happy. 
playing in the leaves. Oh, what a precious. Seriously, like how can you not love this precious little boy? Like in all seriousness, he is adorable. He is like everything. Oh my gosh. Let's see if we can get a, another angle. That's super cute of him. That little face. Oh, it's precious. Okay, anyways, this makes me really happy that he is getting to play in the leaves. Daryl was busy raking it just so he could make this pile for his son, which is precious. And he seems to be really enjoying himself, but oh my gosh, he is exhausted. Oh, dear. All right, so it looks like he wants a drink, so... I don't think, can she get him a drink? What is she doing? <laughs> She's just running off to chat and aww, look. They are being so cute and Daryl has reached level five of parenting. Okay, let's brighten his day and let's, uh, let's teach him to talk for just a little bit and then I think we're gonna go ahead and head home because we got to feed this little one because, or not feed him, but get him to sleep. So, all right, guys, on that note, I think we're going to go ahead and head home because it's getting bad. All right, welcome back, everyone. We are going to get our sweet little boy Vance's issues taken care of, which is using the bathroom and getting some shut eye. Maria is going to come in here, grab some leftovers. But yeah, overall, I think it was a pretty good day. I mean, it's definitely different having a toddler I mean there's a lot more to pay attention to because he gets into trouble and you know he's learning and curious about things but he is adorable a mini little Daryl which is precious and Maria and Daryl did try to conceive again and unfortunately it did not take so Maria she feels a little disheartened but nothing too bad and look Maria is wearing makeup Ooh, girl all right, anyways, so yeah, and then they had some family time at the park for on a Sunday afternoon, Sunday evening, and she's got her birthday coming up this next weekend, and of course, Harvest Fest. So anyways, guys, I think we have a lot of things to look for that are up and coming, and hopefully we can get her to get pregnant again soon, and that way they can continue to expand their family and grow. Also, we need to figure out their housing situation because... This noise stuff is getting so old so fast. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for joining me on this episode of the Solar System Legacy Challenge. And I will catch you all next time. See ya.